Good morning, friends. This is Ari or Arkila Ari. I haven't really figured out how to say my name because I go by Color Me Kingdom. I also go by Lioness Ariel or just Ari. Um, today I wanted to get on here. Um, oh, my song name is Laki Ari. If you want, if you need to look me up for any reason. But I had this thought while I was driving, I really wanted to share. And as y'all can see, the baby is back there asleep, um, which is awesome because he was up all morning. I wanted to get on here and share a thought that I had. I was thinking about how we say like, oh, I just need some peace. Or, oh, I just need, you know, if, if I had, if I knew, better I do better you know and you know all these things that we just think like if we just had this you know we would be where we want to be or where we imagine you know that we would be and you know all of that is just fantasy you know all of that is idleness if it does not include God if God is not included, you may have moments of uh, clarity or you may have moments of uh, peace, uh, excuse me, but with without Christ, it won't last. The only thing that lasts and really truly fulfills us uh, is the Lord. You know, we say, well, if I just had a good job, you know, with all these different figures, <clears throat> I ain't even trying to look cute for y'all. But, you know, we say, yeah, even when it comes to like product productivity, like if I just had, you know, better skin, then maybe I could do what God want me to do. Or, you know, if I, if I had, you know, if I always, if I just looked like this or that, like, Maybe, you know, things will be better or maybe I could get what I want, you know, whatever. The truth is, no, you wouldn't be happy. You wouldn't be truly fulfilled. Nothing's going to satisfy you the way that Christ will. And um, I don't have a scripture off the top of my head right now, but if the Holy Spirit decides to speak, honey, he will. I just had that thought in my mind that... Uh, you know, we're always trying to be better. We're always thinking of what we don't have. Uh, we're always, you know, there's always this thought, right? Like, you know, my life would be better if. The truth is, we need to go to the Father God first, you know, and accept Jesus Christ into our heart and that his Holy Spirit would lead and guide us into all truth um, because that's what the Holy Spirit does. And um, as I was sitting here driving and just thinking of these things, I think, you know, the truth is, is that the only thing that's going to truly fulfill us is what we do in Christ. Those are the things that are going to last. Those are the things that are going to be meaningful. You know, a hundred years from now, you know, are my kids and kids' kids going to say, you know, Grandma Auntie Ari was you know was great she bought us ice cream all the time like maybe <laughs> you know i doubt it <laughs> you know you know but the legacy you lead for jesus the things that you leave for jesus you know things we do for jesus i don't know if i've said it right because i'm kind of sleepy but the things that we do for jesus those are things that are going to last um, so I just want to remind y'all of that. And I want to encourage you um, to just seek God first. You know what? The word of God says, you know, if we ask, we shall have it, you know, and to seek him first and all things will be added to us. But then the word of God also tells us to pray God's will over our life. And that's something that the Holy Spirit revealed to me in the last week. Like, yes, you've been praying, you've been praying, you've been praying. But have you prayed God's will? Because sometimes we think we need peace, we need favor, we need this, we need that, you know? But the truth is, no, we just need Jesus. 
because Jesus is the Prince of Peace. You know, Jesus is the well that never runs dry. He's more than enough, right? And so we just need to pray for Jesus' will. We need to pray for the Father's will in our life. And um, and just watch the abundance, you know. When we surrender to his will and his way, we overflow with all this goodness. And so I just want to encourage y'all, get on here and just say, I love y'all. Don't forget to pray. Peace.